This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Well, Meek Mill finally comes to his senses and apologizes after Vanessa Bryant calls him out for his insensitivity. He claims, he says, I apologized to her in private earlier, not today in the public. Nothing I say on my page is directed to the internet viral moment to the family. Please, then he said, please be respectful of a grieving woman. You disrespected Kobe publicly. How dare you try to play the victim now and act like you're the kind and caring person. Uh, Meek Mill is detached from reality. I'm glad he apologized. I hope it's true. And that's about it. I mean, that's all he needed to do from the jump was realize that it was an insensitive bar and metaphor and just take it back. I mean, be a man. That's what being a man is. You realize when you're wrong, you admit when you're wrong and you apologize. And I'm glad he did that. Uh, so, you know, it's just crazy. We, you know, he had, he had no choice but to say he apologized. So that's that. Then Exhibit, apparently him and his wife are filing for separation uh, after six years of marriage. But they've been together for 20 years and have a kid together. That's pretty sad. Hopefully they can maybe work it out. Honeycomb Brazy visits the site of his grandparents where they passed. Um, says he misses them. You guys raised me. I promise to do everything. Uh... What's it? What did he say? I promise to do everything and hold it down like he promised to. Okay. And then he says, Stop saying my granny and grandpa got their, you know, their house, yeah, their house blew up or something. He, what he's saying was they had, they had the cooties and they were on oxygen tanks. And when those people, you know, popped the house up, they shot the house up, it hit one of the oxygen tanks and it set the house up and they, unfortunately they passed that was so that that was that's sad and that's why you don't want to have so much beef going on and he yeah, has a lot of beef very sad um and lastly we'll talk about and you know shouts out to honeycomb brazy that's all respect right there um jay-z Disclose, it's undisclosed amount what the company paid for half of Ace of Spades, but it's being reported it'd be worth about $250 million, actually. They valued the champagne at $300 million a year and a half ago, but of course, you usually pay a little bit more for a partial stake of a company. So, and it will be worth a lot more once they get the distribution going. Anyways, guys, this is Jordan Tower with JT News with your update. I appreciate you guys, and you have a great day today.